is go down until the next note in that key. Okay, so your your B, your B, sorry, uh, your uh, E. I'm G. Yeah, your E. Gamme de fer, mais hum sur le do. Ouais, tu veux la gamme de fer ou la gamme de sol? You're starting on sol. Going down, going going down the sol. Okay. My name is Jared Goldsmith, and I'm the leader of Sax Appeal, and we're the National Capital Region's premier saxophone quartet. My last job with the government ended in May 2011, and I thought after 10 years of trying to get a permanent job in the government, I, I just wasn't able to get permanent. So I decided to finally throw in the towel, give it everything I have, and start a music ensemble. I started the saxophone in grade seven, and that was in 19, oh, I'm dating myself here, 1987. And I didn't know what I wanted to do after high school. At the time, I was playing in many ensembles, many bands, community bands, jazz bands, and I didn't know what I wanted to do in life. I'm still trying to figure that out, but I'm on my way now. I'm not Aston, I'm a drummer here in Ottawa, and I've done a lot of playing with Jared over the last uh, six or seven years in a few different groups. And um, yeah, we initially met in uh, a band called Alternate Takes, which was pretty busy for a few years and made a record and, and then uh, sort of broke up and moved on to other projects. And since then I've seen Jared a lot. And no matter what project I've seen him in, he's always uh, really excited and really enthusiastic about making really good music. Music's been in my background in my family's background for generations. My grandfather, uh, who likes, used to like to say he sang his way during the war. He was stationed out in Ceylon and in India for a time, and he was a singer. He had a band called the Tarmax, and they toured around Europe and all over the place entertaining troops. The music skipped my parents, on both sides, funny. <laughs> My mother and father can't sing a tune, but that's neither here nor there. And it seems the best of, of both worlds came to me. And I'm trying to make the most of this uh, wonderful experience by playing music and letting people enjoy it. My name is Bernard, Bernard Cloutier. I play uh, saxophone, other instruments, but main, uh, mainly uh, saxophone. In uh, this band, I'm playing the, uh, the, the tenor saxophone. So I've been playing for over, uh, what, 50, 50 uh, not 50, but uh, well, just about 50 some years. When I was 14, I was playing in bars, so, uh, so it, it tells you an idea of the, uh, the amount of years I have uh, behind me. Well, my name is Pierre Léon. Uh, I play uh, lead alto and soprano. Um, I've been playing for 61 years. And uh, yeah, I'm that old. So uh, yeah, I started on the piano and, and then I went to saxophone. And, uh, and I also paid for my studies playing in clubs and this kind of thing. Are going down this from C to Sol. Yeah. Well, C, C is Sol. C to <laughs> Sax Peel rehearses on, once a week. Like, usually during the days at my home. Um, okay. When we have a, an event, we, or I custom tailor the music from our extensive library. I come up with a set list. And then we will have one rehearsal to run down all the pieces. And what makes us different is that we're four saxophones. We're the only quartet in town that actively promotes our services. It's such a unique ensemble, even within the musician's perspective. It's something you don't hear too often. And the general public, for the most part, has never seen or heard of a saxophone quartet. It's, uh, it's unique. Uh, you know, there, 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 there are not uh, there are no other uh, such band in the uh, in the Ottawa area. 
uh, and the sound is very nice. We have four saxophones uh, playing together in harmony. It's, it's, it's very, it's very, uh, very nice to hear. He, uh, he came to my place and uh, presented his project and said, what do you think? And I said, well, uh, this possibilities are there, but it's going to be a lot of work. And little did I know Jared that way, because he's not just a good musician, but he's <laughs> super organized. Oh, and does, and he's got to be the world's best marketer. I'm sure he could sell the fridge to an Eskimo, you know. Somebody was giving away tickets to a wedding show. So, oh, I didn't know there was a wedding show this weekend. So, I picked up two tickets, ran downtown to the convention center, brought a whole bunch of business cards with me, made all sorts of networks. I went around to every single booth and lots of event planners and wedding planners and caterers and, and wedding decor people. And I followed up with them that week. A few days later, somebody called me back to the Museum of Civilization. They said, we have an event which we think you will be perfect for. C'est un groupe dont le slogan est pour un peu de style à une soirée, ajouter du saxophone. C'est le groupe, un quatuor à saxophone par excellence de notre région. Mesdames et messieurs, veuillez accueillir Saxophone. The Museum of Civilization has one of the best sound systems in the city. And the room, the grand hall with the totem poles, it's renowned around Canada. It's very, everybody knows that museum. So when we were there playing for 30 event planners over their dinner and having the recording of that gig, it was an opportunity we couldn't pass up. How do I see sax appeal in the future? I think it will become uh, the predominant saxophone quartet in this part of Canada, simply because not only are they completely unique with very, very few other saxophone quartets out there working, there's uh, lots of potential for a group like that to be really, really busy and doing something pretty unique. And therefore, I think it'll be uh, pretty successful. <laughs>